In the heart of rural Arkansas, where community thrives, there's a bond that ties us together. Petty Gene Fiber. We understand the importance of local relationships. And that's why when it comes to connectivity, our customers deserve the best. Whether working from home, learning remotely, or connecting with loved ones, Petty Gene Fiber delivers more than just high-speed internet. It serves as a gateway to a world filled with limitless possibilities. Petty Gene Fiber. Better internet, better service, better price. I chose a car that would be safe for our family. And when it comes to our financial future, I don't take any chances there either. That's why we bank with Centennial. They give me everything I could want in a bank, from the latest technology to great service. But the biggest thing they give me is confidence. So in a time when there's plenty of things to worry about, my money isn't one of them. What's on your schedule for October 28th? Pump it. Find your couch and spike it. Get around the big TV with all your friends and set it. Arkansas PBS and the Arkansas Activities Association is bringing you the 2023 Centennial Bank State Volleyball Championships presented by Everett Buick GMC. For all the ways to watch, just head over to the website, myarpbs.org slash sports. At American Safeguard Insurance, our job is to make sure you understand exactly what you need so you're covered if your worst case scenario becomes a reality. We offer a variety of coverage options, including personal and commercial insurance, so that your home and business are covered no matter what. Don't settle for less. Experience more savings, more coverage, and more service with American Safeguard Insurance. Hey folks, Sean Gorham here for Cowboys Chevrolet GMC in Heber Springs, the Lake Area's fastest growing GM dealership, where we make your car buying experience easy and enjoyable. Simply shop CowboysChevyGMC.com where you can pick out your vehicle, get an appraisal and free approval, then you can even purchase right there from your living room. Plus, we will even deliver it anywhere in the state. The service don't stop there. We also have a state-of-the-art service facility and collision repair center. So for all your automotive needs, come see us at Cowboys Chevy GMC in Heber Springs. Since 1954, F.L. Davis Ace has proudly served the Greer's Ferry Lake area by providing the best hardware and home improvement needs to our customers. Stop by one of our six Arkansas locations in Greer's Ferry, Heber Springs, Sherwood, Pea Ridge, Fayetteville, or Centerton. And welcome back here to the 2A State Volleyball Tournament live from Quitman High School on the AAA Digital Network compliments of Lake Area Sports and Pettigene Viber as we have reached our last game of the night and it's going to be a good one. It's the LaVaca Golden Light Lady Arrows out of the 2A West coming in with a record of 22 and 11 and they will take on the Conway Christian Lady Eagles out of the 2A North, the number one seed coming in with a record of 24 and 1. One of these teams will be taking on the Mansfield Lady Tigers on Saturday at 1 o'clock. So here's a little setup to how this is all going to happen here. Conway Christian made the semifinals in 2022, got beat by Lavaca. 2021, they got beat in the quarterfinals by Mansfield. 2020, they got beat in the quarterfinals by Lavaca. Okay, so go over here to Lavaca. They are the 2022 2A runner-up. They got beat by Levi uh, Mansfield. In 2021, they made the semifinals. And in 2020, they were the runner-up. And in 2021, they got beat in the semifinals by a team that just got beat, Lifeway Christian. Rodney, this is going to be a ball game. Yeah, I mean. It, it, this is the game it, of the tournament. It's shaping up. This could be another five-setter. Yep. Uh, I mean, you look at Conway Christian, their only defeat is to Mansfield. Yes. That speaks pretty good. And matter of fact, Conway Christian was the last team, I think that's what you said, was the last team to 
win a set against Mansfield. Yeah, it was. And yep. So and uh, you've got Lavaca over here. Lavaca, and of course, I mean, you. The record is deceiving. Twenty-two and eleven. I mean, the eleven defeats. They probably three of them to Mansfield. Yeah. So, yeah, you just gotta, you know, throw the records out of the book. And this is gonna be very interesting. It will be. It's gonna be a very good ball game. Yep. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna flip it right down to the main speakers for Coach Brandon Bergner to bring you the starting lineups as we get ready to start this semifinal, last one of the night. Association by like Columbia Equipment High School, the host of the 2023 2A State Volleyball Tournament. This time we'll introduce the starting players for this game, beginning with our visiting team on the scoreboard, the Lavaca Golden Arrows. Senior number four, Madison Proctor. Senior number 12, Willow Houston. Junior number 15, Bailey Stockton. Senior number 16, Emerson Schaefer. Sophomore number 22, Marley Smith. Sophomore number 33, Cammie Ertz. Senior number 11, Abby Melton. And for the home team on the scoreboard, the Conway Christian Lady Eagles, coached by Cody McKnight, Mary Nathol, and Corey Hutchinson. Senior number 3, Abby Holden. Ashlyn Kinley. Senior number 10, Jenna Gall. Senior number 11, Emma Riddle. Junior number 17, Emma Carver. Junior number 20, Savannah Schusman. Senior number 1, Kate Strongin. And senior number 8, Mary Bella Pasco. Your officials for this game are Patty Hill, Shanna Raper, Stephen, and Amanda Gray. Get things ready to go as they will meet under the net. Alright. Once again, 24 and 1 for the Conway Christian Raven Eagles. 27, 22, and 11 for the Raven Back at the Golden Arrows. Here's how both of them got here. As we go into the bracket real quick here. Let's get that started. Lavaca knocked off England yesterday. And Tom Richardson knocked off Faden yesterday. In the first round, Lavaca knocked off Barton. And Tom Richardson knocked off Magic Cole. That's how we got here to this point. The Lady Tigers were victorious in three sets over the life of the Lady Warrior. 34-2 on the year. They're waiting on their opponent at the Bank of OZK Arena, which will be at 1 p.m. on Saturday. Good crowd for both schools here tonight. Should be a very interesting matchup. It looks like the Conway Christian Lady Eagles will be doing the serving. Here we go, Rock. Ready. We're ready. And that's going to be Kinley serving for the Lady Eagles. It's a very loud gymnasium here. Good crowd. Both both teams got a real good crowd. And there the first point will go to the Lady Eagles. Oh my goodness, she kicked it up. Number 20, number 11, Abby Melton kicked it up. And they kept it going, and the first point will go to the Lavaca Lady Golden Lions. I missed that completely. I did too. I was looking down. I was, <laughs> yeah. And I'm going to say it was in for the Lady Eagles. Now it's one to one. Going to serve now for the Lady Eagles. It'll be. Number 11, Emma Reynolds. There's a kill by number four, Madison Walker. Yeah. 
Right. Senior didn't want to miss that one, did she? Right. Number 22, Marley Smith. Will be serving. Nice dig there by Scroggins. And way too hard there off of Jenna Gell. 3 1 lead here for the Lavaca Golden Lady Lions. Lady Arrows. Big up there by Scroggins. Now Scroggins. Real opportunity there. Nice play there by Scroggins. And it just barely gets over the net. Kill now by number 15. Stockton and the point's going to go to the Lady Eagles as it was out of bounds. I mean, she just got it over the net. Just, it just rolled over that net. Yep. This will be the arrow for Katie Scroggins. Too far there to stop and block in the net by number 32, Emma Rice. Three to three. Rogers will continue to serve. Now, oh, oh. good opportunity there, but points going to go to number 16, Emerson Schaefer. For the Lady Golden Arrows. Ashley Kim, she just could not get to it. Okay. Now serving will be Madison Proctor. The Lady Eagles. Now it's tapped over there. Now Rice. That back side there is going to pick up the Lady Eagles. There's Rice with the kill. That's good. We've got one, one heck of a set going here. Yes, we do. Number two, Brooklyn Pratt coming in to serve here. That'll be up over across the net now. Oh, oh, yeah. And they're going to say that's the end. Yeah. And she threaded the needle. Five to four now. There's a kill by number oh. three. It's out of bounds. And point four to the back of Golden Lady Arrows. And it's still serving will be Willa Don Houston. He's going to go across the net. And nobody's there. No communication by the Lady Eagles. Seven to four now. He's took on a run here, two points, two quick points by her. There's a kill by number nine, Kinley picked up there. Now, Melton get across. Now, nice dig there by the Lady Arrows. That was Marley Smith. Now, that's Stockton. Now, kill there by Stockton again. That was maybe Stockton. Now on the block of the net. And there's another block there, but now picked up there by Melton. Now Stockton across the net. Now Lady Eagles, quickly hit. A nice dig there. Good save by the Lady Eagles as they're getting across. Wow. What a volley we got going here. Now there's a kill. And out. Oh, he in there by number 16, Emerson Shaker. And the run continues for Houston. Setting up Kinley, Kinley picked up there by Melton. Now setting up for Earth with the kill. Five quick points and a timeout has been called. We'll take it with them. Taylor is here on the Kinley Digital Network. Compliments of the case. Custom pay 
featuring Brody and Brooklyn Jewelry. to the Triple-A Digital Network, compliments of Lake Area Sports. As we are in this first set, and it's been about to go to Lady Leon Arrows. Scoring seven in a row now. Making it 10 to four. I keep calling Lady Leon's as Golden Arrows. Now Lady Golden Arrows will serve. That's used to, she's had a great run here. They scored seven in a row. I set up there by Stockton. Now Stockton with another dig there. And she ran out, excuse me. That was used to because she's gotten away as her teammate and couldn't do nothing with it. Yeah, they, <clears throat> they couldn't go around her and they couldn't get over her. Yep. Well, they didn't want to step on her. Lady Go Narrows knocked off the Lady Eagles last year in the semifinals. Way too much hard, hard there for Shoesmith. And gives it back to Lady Go Narrows. 11 to 5 here in this first set. It was a very loud gym. This is the loudest this gym has been. All state tournament. Pratt's going to set up. And blocked to the net, but that was number three. Hadley Holden with the point there for the Lady Eagles. Making it 11 to 6. And that will bring in, so is that number eight? Ryan Pasco. Pasco will serve, sorry, Ryan. Pasco will get it across. That's eight. I hit up there by Kinley. Kinley will get it across. Now Melton, now setting up. That was Stockton with the kill. Haley Stockton. Well, this is going to work. Yep. And Bobby Melton will serve. Yep. There by Shoesmith. And hit across by Kinley. And it's set up number 22, Marley Smith. And it's blocking the net. That point for the lady. Golden Arrows. Drug up there by the lady Eagles. And killed by number 11. And the winner just picked over it. Picked up. Across there by the Lady Eagles. And Stockton again now. Coach Goggins has set him up. Got to hit it back across. He can't get something set up. And a kill there by number 12, Caroline Huff. Will be Kate Scroggins, 13 to 7. Miss, Miss Kingsley. Excuse me. Miss Kingsley. Oh! And diving for it. The bodies are in the way. They can't get around them. And that will go down as a point for the Eagles. It's got a bunch, both things that have a bunch of players on the floor. Go down. Kingsley on the serve. Block of the net there by number 17, Emma Carver, and it's still going. And so what a save by the Lady Golden Arrows. Another one! Oh my goodness! Proctor this time gets it over the net. And Milton now to the backside was Schaefer. Now Schaefer's going to hit it up in the air high. And get it across Wills and Stockton. Oh, oh, 
in wow. there by Kate Scroggins. Great volley of blocks the net by number four, Madison Proctor, and number 15, Stockton. Wow. Proctor just, she was just waiting on that block. Lady Rolling Arrows have really kept it up over on that side. And that Whoa. is going out the hands there of Emma Carver. Point for the Lady Arrows. Well, another timeout. Let's take it with them. Stay with us here. Lake Area Sports on the Triple A Digital Network. When it comes to the integrity of Google, it takes a knowledgeable team to ensure trust in the property and stock the study materials that will last. Family owned and operated with over 17 years experience, the team at that trust will provide. And welcome back here to the AAA Digital Network Conference of Lake Area Sports. It's the Lady Golden Arrows 15, Lady Eagles 8 here on this first set. And we'll make that 16 to 8 on that ace there by number 15, Maylee Stockton. And the Stockton will be continuing so for Lady Golden Arrows. And off of Shoesmith. Shoesmith couldn't do nothing with it there. You know, these last two serves have been on that back line. He's been eating those about girls up. Yep. There it is again, right at Shoesmith. And there's a block by Jenna Gill. A kill, excuse me. Emma Reynolds. Yep. Yeah. And here's the golden line. Arrows getting it across. A nice play there by Stockton. Get back across. And Stockton is going to pull oh. quick. And she's going to get the point for that. Thought she's seen it and said, up. Oh, I cut you. When, when you think somebody's got it. A point, you know, it's going to be, when you, go, when you look off a second, the other team's going to come back and get it. Holly Smith. Now here for it by Rice. Now Rice with the kill. Dug up, but not too much. There's too many girls on the floor there. Nobody's getting around each other there. And point's going to be for the Lady Eagles as they'll come to serve. Going 18 to 10 in this first set. Kate Scroggins. Now Kill there, now picked up there by Scroggins. That was Gill. Now Gill again, now going around her was Kinley. And Rice. That was Rice on the far side. Now dug up there by Holden. Now hit back across there by. Kinley, there's Crocker. A good play there by Marley Smith. That's Rice. No way. Well, Barrow, Milton couldn't do nothing with it. Good hustle there by Stockton as she tried to get to it. And serving will be still Caitlin Scroggins. Here it across, hit up there by Melton, now Stockton, now hit across by Schaefer. And they're going to get Schaefer into the net, I think. Yep. She come yeah. running and couldn't, couldn't put them bucks on fast enough. Nope. Stockton's with the team to serve. Stockton. Oh! 
Oh, miscommunication right there. Yeah. 18-13 now. Conway Christian sort of on the roll right now. They're on the run right now. Dogging. Get their body. Melton now. Melton will get it across the net. And there's a kill by Madison Proctor. Serving Madison Blockford. Madison will get it across. And get back across by the Lady Eagles. That's eight. Dug up there by Gale. And two hard. Schaefer points for the Lady Eagles. The Eagles will come to serve. It's going to be number two, Booker and Pratt. And over there by Schaefer now. That's Rice, now dug up there by Stockton. Scroggins up there, up there by Milton. Now, the back line, good pressure there by Scroggins, but point for Lady Stockton and the Lavaca Golden Arrows. 20 to 14 now. Holy And it's a nice kill with the up. Now Milton's going to get across the net. Pratt setting up, rise on that far side, goes up there by the Lady Arrows. Now Pratt will get, goes up there by Schaefer. Now rise back to Pratt, now they just tap it over to Kinley. Up in the back across, into the net, it's going to be Abby Melton. And then point for the Lady Eagles. The Eagles have cut it to five once, but they can't get it under five. And they're going to bring Savannah Shoesmith to serve. Shoesmith, oh, oh, what a dig. And there's a kill there, but now picked up there by the Lady Arrows. Good job there by Pratt. Mm. Another good dig there by Bonnie Smith. And in the net, Will Schaefer, 20 to 16. Lavaca. Yeah, let's take it with him. Here we go. We'll be back on the AAA Digital Network. When it comes to the integrity of Google, it takes a knowledgeable team to ensure trust that they properly install the study materials that will last. Currently owned and operated with over 17 years' experience, the team at that trust will provide the customized or premium trust installation services at a fair price. That trust provides themselves on a fire which will stand the test of time. The quality trust is built to last. Contact that trust at 870 to schedule your project estimate today. As it's going to be the Eagles making a roar back into this game, and there's another point for the Lady Eagles. We told you this was going to be a back and forth battle, and it is. Thought the Lady Golden Arrows was going to really come on and do something, and then the Lady Eagles have really made a coming. Going back into it. Unforced error again. And a point. And that is Savannah Schusman still serving. 20 to 18. Schusman. Goes up there by the Lady Golden Arrows. Now across to Schaefer. Out of bounds. 20 
to 19. Sue Smith has come in and really made a difference on her serve. Sue Smith again. Barely over the net. Oak couldn't do nothing with it. 20 to 20 now. 2020. Another small serve. And a kill there. Oh, went back to Lavaca. Went out of bounds. Oh, they're going to say out of bounds on the Lady Eagles. Yeah. 21 20 now. Now serving will be number 16, Emerson Schaefer. For the Golden Arrows, picked up there by Pratt. Now Schaefer. Pushing it across, there's the Lady Golden Arrows. That's big, oh! Back here, for the Golden Eagles, they get it across. Now setting up on the far side, there's Smith into the net, 21-21. And there I went and <laughs> didn't, got hung up in this and I wasn't, <laughs> wasn't paying attention. Pasco will be serving here for the Lady Eagles. Oh, picked up there by Shoesmith. Oh, oh. 22 21 now. Lady Golden Arrows. And they are coming to serve now. And they're going to have their libero, Abby Melton, serving. Now Pratt's going to set it up. Kinley. That's blocked with the net. Now bumped across. Now Golden Arrows. That's Stockton for the kill. Proctor's all over the place. That was Proctor, excuse me. Yeah, she does be correct me on that. <laughs> she's just, I mean, she's everywhere. There's some Proctor on the kill. And Pratt's going to set up Kinley again. And point set point now for the Golden Arrow, Lady Golden Arrows. And they got the Roberto, Abby Melton, serving. Shoesmith, Pratt, I hit across there, Biles, or oh, Cuff. I hit back across, Biles, Marley Smith. And blocked to the net, still alive for the Lady oh. Eagles. And the Lady Gola Lions are going to Arrows have won the first set, 25 21.
looks not that way anymore. Red River Ram. If you're looking for a Ram truck, we got heavy duty four wheel drive trucks starting at $49.5 or up to $12,000 off super price for a Cummins diesel. We've got $11,000 off Ram 1500 big horn four wheel drive truck. You want the best selection and the best buying experience? Make that beautiful drive right here in the Beaver Street. Now doing Ram holidays. So this old lady makes make her own shows. So if they want to give you some drives, they're going to do these things that they need to do that for you. Helping a wide variety of all your ready mix movements for you. We are from Earth, Hopkins, Hopkins, Sunday, Gravel, Landscape Drive, Coastal Google, B-Stone, B-Gravel, and Fountain. Give us a call today at 501. And now serving for the Lego Narrows is this Stockton. Leading here 1 0. There you go, sorry about the Lego. Going into the net there was number nine, Ashley Kimmy. 1 0 lead here for the Lady. Golden Arrows is, they took the first set 25 21. All right, we're back across there. We'll do shoot man. A proud way to that. A nice dig there by the lady. Arrows, and they're going to say they got into the net. Four hits, so one to one now. Good block, by Lady Eagles. Yep, it's going to be Lady Eagles serving now. That's going to be number nine, Ashley Kimmel. And just could not right. get it over the net. Blocked there by number 17, Emma Carter. Making it two to one, Lady Eagles. Yes, because Miss Carter come up and she was going to make a kill. Ashley Kimmel is still serving. Now Carter, a dug up there by Huff. Still up on 22, just hit the back on the back side. Good job there by number nine, Ashley Kimmel. And another good, there's Huff. Oh! And Shoesmith couldn't get it back into the bare territory and it's too deep. That's a good volume by both teams. Yep, Marlon Smith now. Yeah. So. And blocked with the net there by Madison Proctor. Point for the Lady Arrows. Serving will be Marley Smith. That's an up there with Gail. And back across for Houston. And blocking an up there by Madison oh. Walker. What a save there by Gail. And back across. There's the Lady Eagles that was Gail getting it back across. Great volume on my both teams here. Yes. Right up there. On the back side, and you can hear them talking, but uh, nobody was moving over there. Just when you think, arrows. You know, you think somebody's got the advantage, the yeah. other one just will show up. I serve with Caroline Huff, and she serves out of bounds. And she will immediately go to the bench. Coming in for her was under. Little Gill. She has number 11, Emma Reynolds. Now Gill will get it across. Sitting up with 16 Emmys and Schaefer. And Pratt's going to try to get it over. Ross couldn't do nothing with it. And then the Lady Arrows take a 5-3 lead here in the second set. And 
serving again is number four, Madison Pluckton. Pluckton will hit it over. That Ross, Ross couldn't do nothing with it. Six to three now, Golden Arrows. Madison Pluckton now. That's what it across. Ross will hit it up. Now Ross going to bump it back across. Now big there by Stockton, but nobody was there to help her. And that uh, makes it 6-4 now, or Lady Arrows. And coming serve will be number one, Kate Struggles. Struggles are getting across. Oh, nice kill by number 16, Emerson Schaefer. Seven to four now here in the second set. And serving will be Houston. Up there by Scroggins. And setting it up there for Emma, for Jenna Gill with the kill. Looking at seven to five. And number two, Booker and Pratt will come in to serve. Threads the needle for a point. Eight to four now, eight to five. Back and forth. And this is Schaefer now serving. Little <laughs> by Kinley, but that down a little very working. That's Pratt. Stuck up in the net. Got to get across with Ross. Good pick. Oh, Ross. Good block. LeBron did and so is Hadley Holden. He thought the Golden Arrows, the way the Golden Arrows was ready to collect on that. Yeah. Well, I don't know where that block. Now Emerson Rice will serve. Tapped over there by the Lady Arrows. Back to their side. Schaefer again. She's going to stalk them. Got to put them by Stockton. Now they're going to set up Marty Smith. And point for the go, uh, Lady Eagles. Proctor's been on the bench quite a while here. Yeah, you know, a little bit of rest with that one on lead. Oh, what a she, throw. Can do nothing there. Abby Melton is, she's kind of in no man's land. Tied this set up. Eight to eight. Yep. And into the net, there was Crap. Nine eight now, Lady Arrows. Serve. Yep. Yeah. 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 And that block at the net there by Madison Proctor. He called for it. I mean, she's back in. Comes back in the first time. She makes her present money. I'll say it still will be out of no time. Scroggins. Yeah, setting it up on the far side. Yeah. Too hard there for Caroline Huff. Seven to eight now. Try to sit back up hard. That's going to be number three. Holding the position. Now Shays or Stockton. And blocked with the net by Stockton and Proctor. Point for the Golden Arrows. Seven to eight now. Continues to serve. Oh, ace. ace. Or Milton. Cleared timeout. Lady Eagles. Let's take it with them here on the AAA Digital Network. We'll be back. Cool. 
is more water sports. Now, a whole lot of fishing are located at 7560 Edgemont Road. Stop by and check out the good hand for you and for the prices. If you're looking for something special, check them out on Facebook. You can send them any firearms questions. Or you can call 501 270 Back here to the AAA Digital Network, Compliments of Lake Area Sports. And they're going to get number three, Hadley Hogan, into the net. But they're 14 to, to 8 lead here for the Lady Golden Arrows of Rebecca. And there's another ace for the Golden Arrows. And that's Abby Milton still serving. Now Melton, good, good try, good try there for Melton. But the kill was by number 12, Caroline Huff. To get the inch back to in the serve, back to the Lady Eagles. Coming to serve, will be Mary Bella Pascal. Schaefer. And a quick hit there. Now Schaefer pushes it back into the corner. And out of bounds there by number 17, Emma Carter. Back to the Lady Golden Arrow, 16 to 9. Madison Proctor was just waiting on that one. 17 at the end. Just, just barely put it over the net and see what happens. Yeah. All right, we'll be back after these words from our great sponsors and a couple of ways. Did you know that one? Yeah, 
Ron Hood blocking the nets to a lob, but out of bounds. 19 to 10. And that corner series will be number nine, Ashley Kimmel. And there's the kill for number four, Madison Proctor, making it 20 to 10. She's making the bid to be all state. Yes, she is. Oh, this is it, Dan. They can make a good choice for that. A lot of good ones up here this year. Now Schaefer will kick it back across. That's you, sir. And a kill there for number 17, Emma Carter. She got that one down. Yes, she did. And coming to serve will be number 12, Caroline Huff. Schaefer's going to have to get it across. Now the Schaefer's almost an old man's land there. Now Schaefer, she's on the hole. Oh, oh nice day. Schaefer will kick it back across. Good job there by Melanie Smith to help out that backside. And there's the kill for number 10, Jenna Girl. Out of bounds, point to the Lady Eagles, and here come the Lady Eagles, storm back into this one. Schaefer, Stockton, Proctor picked up there by Scroggins. Melton, Stockton. Schaefer will just tap it over. Shoe Smith with a fade. Oh, my and a good across there was Caroline Huff. What a volley by both teams. And there's a kill by Savannah Shoe Smith. And they're roaring back into this one 20 to 14 now. Well, you know, that was the first set. They did the same thing. Got down like that. Schaefer is going across. Nice dig there by Gill. Right up across by Pratt. Now Proctor's is going to tap it over. Get it back up with Carver. Now they're going to push it back across. Now Schaefer, there's Scroggins again. Oh. Now she's going to kiss too hard. 21 14 now. The back of Golden Arrow is coming to show she's excited, isn't she? Yeah. <laughs> Rocker will serve. Oh, an ace. Ace there for Proctor, 22 14. Lady Arrow's won the first set, 25 21. And they're going to take a 2 0 lead here in this state semifinal game. To the net there by Proctor. And play the conference rate in the, spin, the state finals at Banco's UK Arena for the second year in a row. Strawberry. I'm melting. And that was Oak. With a point there for Oak. 23 now for 15. Coming to serve will be Willa Don with Houston. Back to the cross. Roberts. Now setting up Rice. In that far corner, it's good. 23 16 now. Back to the serve will be the senior Brooklyn Brock. That'll get it across. Now Rice again and blocked out of bounds, but point for the Lady Eagles. 23-17 now. We'll have enough left. 
to get it back down and tie it up. Back up in the air now. Stockton's going to get it across. Now, Rice again. Back up there by Stockton. Now, Schaefer out of bounds. 23 18. Big one here for the Lady Eagles of Conway Christian. Point draws of Milton's hands. 23 19. Timeout. Timeout. Lovaca. Let's take it with him here on the AAA Digital Network. In the heart of rural Arkansas, where community thrives, there's a bond that ties us together. Heavy Gene Fire. We understand the importance of local relationships, and that's why when it comes to connectivity, our customers deserve the best. Whether working from home, learning remotely, or connecting with loved ones, Heavy Gene Fiber delivers more than just high speed. It serves as a gateway to a world filled with limitless possibilities. Heavy Gene Fiber. Better internet, better service, better class. Back here at AAA Digital Network. Lady Eagles trying to score back into this one. Oh, and there's another ace. 23-20. And Proctor's still on the bench. You know, ever since she made that last serve, it looked like she had a, a hamstring or a muscle. Safe on the beginning call. Good there. Last kill, but it's pulled up there by the Lady Arrows. Now hit across there by Stockton. Now it's tapped over. Number nine, Ashley Kinley, 23-21. Brooklyn Pratt will continue to serve. And two are. Set point here for the Lady Arrows. And that's going to be Emerson Schaefer. Schaefer will get it across. Set up there by Scroggins. Pushed across there by Kinga. Set up number 22, Marley Smith. And there it is. 25, 21, two set lead for the Lady Arrows. From Lavaca on the Lady Eagles at the Wiggers. Hey, Wiggers here on the Triple H Digital Network. We'll be back in about three minutes for this third
She gets an ace off of it. Schaefer. There's Parker again. Parker with another kill. Oh, dug up there again. Now Schaefer with a kill opportunity. Too far deep. Out of bounds. So we'll be number one, Kate Stoggins. Into the net, Russ Stoggins, five to two here. 
Kind of digging that hole again, and it's going to bring in Proctor. She almost had ice there. And Proctor was waiting on Herb to do something with it, and Herb wasn't ready for it. Proctor goes out again. Yeah. I don't know if she's hurt or tired. Yeah. But there's something. Well, you got a 3-0 lead. You have a 2-0 lead right now. You might as well just go. Keep your legs fresh. Yeah. And out of bounds off of a U stick and it gives the Lady Eagles the point and the ball back. And that's Brooklyn Pratt serving. Pratt will serve it across. Schaefer will tap it back. And the kill down the line was number 32, Emerson Rice. And we are knotted at five. Miss Rice has played sensation in this whole. Yes, she has. Oh, my God. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Give her three. <laughs> in the goal it goes. That's the first one. Yes. And a point's going to be awarded to the Lady Eagles. What a basket. <laughs> Good across. There's Ross again along the side. Picked up there by Milton. Now Schaefer. Picked up there by Scroggins. Now pushed across. Now Schaefer. Now Stockton Schaefer. Put back across there by Keeley. Now push back across by the Lady Arrows. Now push back in that far corner by Holden. And they kept the ball to go. Now Rice kill. Picked up there by Marley Smith. Now open the kill. Wow. Now Stockton's going to push it over to Shaver. Shaver's just going to push it back across. Now here comes Ross for a kill block to the net. Oh! And point for the Lady Eagles, making it 7-5. Well, this could be the... This is what they might have needed just to... Mom, their nose is good. Right. Melton. Hurt. Rice again. Goes up there by Smith. And Schaefer again. And Schaefer's going to get the point down for the arrow. Lady Arrows. And Pratt's going to set up Rice on this side. It's good. Oh my goodness, what a kill. Rice goes out now. No, well, Rice is coming out. And look who's coming in to serve. That is Savannah Shoesmith. Shoesmith, that first set, she really brought him back. Schaefer just pushing it over. And blocking the net there by Schaefer. And hurt. The seven now. And serving will be number 16. And it's in shape. Oh, she didn't get that one over. Net. They're in nine to seven now. That's going to come to show you now. Now Schaefer's going to hit it up. Smith's going to have to tap it over. Try to set up Hub. Now it's picked up there by Milton. Now Smith. And Milton's going to do another with it. 10 to 7 now. Still serving will be Pasco. 
They're inching their way more and more. Now the Eagles are. Yep. Smith is going across. Yeah, they're back across there by Kinley. Stockton, now Kinley's going to set up. Number 17, Emma Carver, point for Carver with the kill. Oh, ace in that far corner. It really looked like it was going out, and there's that curveball again. Yep. Time out, Lavaca. We'll take it with them. Stay with us here at Lake Area Sports. Say it was in point for the Lady Arrows. Well done. That was just in, but it was a. She put it in the only spot. She couldn't. Back, back in. Oh, being sorry, excuse me. And two. Oh, they're going to say it was off of the Lady oh. Arrows' hand. Point for the go, uh, Lady Eagle. I missed that one. That'll be 13 or 18. Locked his back in. Locked his back in, yeah. And out of bounds. 14 or 8 now. The Eagles trying to get their mojo going. Oh, the Eagles are going to be burning fire here. Number 12. Hugs running into the net. 14 to 9 now. The Golden Arrows will come to serve. And that will be Ailey Stockton. Stockton again across the net. Uh, he crossed there out of bounds. 14 to 10. Now, Golden Arrow trying to charge back into this. Yep. We knew it was going to be a back and forth, and the first two sets have showed it. 25 21 on both sets. I picked up there. Now, let's see if they're going to set up. Smith on this corner. I picked up there by Pratt. Blocked to the net. They're going to get a net violation on Miss Madison Blocker, making it 15 to 10 now. So Blocker with a kill, oh. and there's Blocker making a point. Uh, our appearance there. That's going to be number 22, Molly Smith serving. So, that's going to be a rotation in the front line right now. I think that's what they're doing. They're waiting on that rotation in the front line. They're going to be in that. Give me some rest. And then Schaefer is going to push it across. There's Strong is with another save. And now they're going to push the ball across. Let's see if we can get blocked right here. 
Walked away the kill. Almost another. And it's going to be in off of the hands of Marley Smith. Point for the Lady Eagles. 16 to 11 now. Scroggins will serve. And the Eagles faithful are trying to get something going there. Well, up there by Smith. Now Schaefer is going to push it over. Good hustle there by number nine, Ashley Kinley. But couldn't do nothing with it. 16 to 12 now. Doctor Sullivan. Doctor will serve. She'll probably go out after this one. Now Doctor. Schaefer. Oh. And gets it over. Wow. Oh. Into the net. She wanted that kill and just could not get it. That block is now going out. Now coming in. And they'll be flipping crap and saving for the Eagles. 17 to 12. Goes up there by Melton. There's Schaefer with a big kill. Off the hands of Emma Reynolds. I thought for a minute we were going to get a basket out of that one, but it just wasn't no way. There's a serve. That's one right of the three pieces. Used to, uh, used to couldn't do nothing with it. 18 to 13 now. Smith will be the server for the Lady Eagles. Oh, ace for Shoesmith. Have one backing up, one going. I thought she was going to get it. Yep. That did good by Marley Smith. Now sets up Shaver, and Shaver can be another right with it. Try to read the other run the net there, 20 to 13. Time out. Time yeah. out by the Lady Golden Arrows. Take your rhythm. Stay with us there. The Triple A Digital Network. When it comes to the integrity of rhythm, it takes a knowledgeable team to ensure our choice of property and stock to study materials that we have. They will only operate with over 17 years experience. A team that have trust will provide customized with premium trust installation services on the third floor. Trust provides themselves in the final product they have to with a scaling of trust at the time. The quality trust is built to win this contact and have trust. 870-948-2105 to schedule your project estimate today. Is Miss Shoesmith strokes it into the net 20 to 14 now in this third set. The uh, Golden Arrows leading 2 0 right now. Across there, West Smith's blocked to the net. Oh. Oh, that's too many hits. Yep. 20 to 15 now. Heck of a dig out. Yep. Just couldn't lift it far enough. Schaefer still serving. Another good there. Good, good there by the... Another one by Milton. Now Smith's going to tap it across. Now time to set up for the kill. Milton will get it back across. Still alive, it's still alive. Oh. It is way still alive. What a dig. And too far. Oh, oh they're gonna say it's off of the oh. back of the yep. 
I tell you what, number 22, Marley Smith, she made one heck of a dig just a while ago. Had to, because I was giving the point to the Lady Eagles, right? Thank you. Number eight, Pasco Sullivan into the net. 21-16 now. And Proctor has come back in. And going out is hurt. And serving will be Abby Melton. Melton going across. And ace! I was giving that ace, but a kill there for Ashley Kennedy. 16 now, and guess who's serving? Miss Ashton Kinney. Can she get it over? They had a couple of them. She could get it over. Now they get it over. And it's blocked her. It. It's back there. That's Brogdon's. And blocked the man again. Still alive. Another dig. Wow. Another dig. Right, this time. The dig was number 15, Molly Stockton, with a dig. 22-17 now. And Stockton's coming to serve. Oh! And into the net. And the Reynolds will be serving. Yep. Good across the net. There's Proctor, blocked in the net by number 17, Emma Carter. And what they're going to say is out of bounds off of Emma Carter. And points going to go to the back of Golden Lady Arrows. Now serving will be Marty Smith. Now Schaefer. Now Rice, point, Eagles. One point away, this is set for this set. Match point here, I'm out, it's up for it. Four Lady Eagles. And they have their libero, Kate Scroggins saving it. Schaefer, lock of the net. And Lady Eagles will run that set. 25-18, and we will be back here in just about three minutes for the fourth set as it's now 2-1 in this game. Stay with us here at the Triple A Digital Network. Come with us, Rick Mansfield.
Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. Had to go out and check the weather. It's raining. And the doctor got the first point in this four set. Yep. Looks like I'm going to get wet in the football game now, Rod. Right? Yeah. One or nothing, Lavaca here. to the corners. The Lady Eagles just won that third set, 25 18. One to one here. Yes, sir. Oh, let me get my camera back. And serving will be number nine, Ashley Kinley. Walker behind her as she gets a lift there. Two yeah. on now. The, the, setup, the setter put it back behind her and she had to reach and pull it. Yeah. Kinley with the two to serve. To the net now, Parker gets it across. Oh, Shaker what a, with a save. save! Smith is jumping across. Now, Parker now another dig by Melton. Now, Scroggins. Drop it back across as Gale. It's going to be down. I thought if she had to say it again, that was Marley Smith. So he won that. He made me have to twist my neck quick. I, I thought I missed one. <laughs> Give up on him. Oh, no. Block the block of the net. Now, Schaefer. Back across there, picked up there and now Scroggins. Now oh. blocked to the net there was Kinley. And point for the Lady Golden Arrows. And you know who was at the, the middle of that block? Yeah. Miss Proctor. Steve <laughs> Smith. Now the kill opportunity there for Gale is into the net. Now nodded at three. Dig there by Sue Smith. That's all she could do with it was dig it back up and do something with it. Makes it three to four. The Golden Arrows. Now, Carver with the uh, kill. Makes it four to four. I 
that on the net, Schaefer. The old end is talking, now back across to the Schaefer. It's Groggins. Now back across there by Schaefer. There's Proctor. Point for the Golden Arrows, five to four now. Now Ross will come back in. That's well, that's going to be over in the middle. He's going to serve his Proctor. Yeah. There's Rice out of bounds. She locks that, court, that sideline over there. Yes. Six to four now. Proctor will continue to serve. Oh, oh and yeah. there hit a player, one player, and this is Schaefer. And Proctor goes out again. Now coming to serve will be Kate Scroggins. It is six to five now. Now Hurt. Picked up there by Emma Reynolds. Now Rice again, out of bounds, Rice. And now Sullivan will be number 22, Marley Smith. Smith will across. Now back, up and across to the Lady Arrow. Hurt. Get up there by Ashley King, now Pratt. Now Rice. Nice kid stick there by, or did by Milton. Now Schaefer will get it back to him. Now Gale, too far. Point for the Golden Arrows. Eight to five now. Into the net now, point for the Eagles. Nine, eight to six now. Serving. Just look on track. Try to get it across. Smith. Houston. Now Schaefer. And Schaefer with the kill. Yeah, his Reynolds couldn't get out of the way. And Schaefer will come to serve now for the golden line. David Taylor. <laughs> There by Reynolds. Now Rice is just going to tap it over. Look at Melton laying her body on the line. What a kick there by Melton. Yes. Now Houston. Now Melton. Setting up and stocking. Now Rice going to sit on the backside. And that was Finley. McKinley, and she's not setting herself. I thought they were going to go over to Rice. Time out. Yep. No Eagles. Good time out there by the Lady Eagles coach. They can win them here at the Lady Eagles. Two teams will punch their ticket to the 2A state 
volleyball final to, on Saturday at Bank OZ Care Arena against the Mansfield Lady Tigers. The teams win a rematch with them. Now Oak, off to the net by Reynolds. Excuse me, Reynolds up holding. Holding now, blocking the net by Oak. Oak says, I'll return the favor. <laughs> 12 to 6 now. And they've got that lead. They're stretching that lead out. Oh. Thank you. Oh, that block. Oh, the Scroggins, excuse me. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. They're going to up to Smith. Smith picked up there by Scroggins. Now Rice is going to run out of room. And they're going to run out of hits, making it 13 to 6. Just led too far there by Kinley as they're trying to get it over to Ross. And Schaefer continues to serve. Now here's our hat. Reynolds. And there's a point there for Holden. Well, let's see if the Lady Eagles can cut into this lead. It's going to be Anderson Rice serving. Ooh, good serve. Oh, what a big. Smith gets it back across. And ball's still alive. Ball's still alive. Oh, look at this. They got it back across. Wow, wow, wow. I mean, Schaefer. Yeah. Hurt gave up. And out of O'Johns out of bounds. You, you, you thought Conway had lost it, and then all of a sudden you were. The Walker has lost it. The belt laid it over there. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Melton. Playing in 13 to 8 here in this third set. Oh, too hard, making a 14 to 8. Oh, 13 to 9, excuse me. Here's the Lady Eagles trying to make their run. That's Emerson Rice. Oh, Rice. Back across is Kinley. What a saved opportunity there by Melton. She is putting her body on the line. Oh, isn't she there? Diving everywhere. And they just take a timeout. Lady Golden Earls. Yep, let's take it with them. Stay with us here at the Triple A Digital Network. In the heart of rural Arkansas, where community thrives, there's a bond that ties us together. Petty Gene Fox. We understand the importance of local relationships, and that's why when it comes to community, our customers deserve the best. Whether working from home, learning remotely, or connecting with loved ones, Petty Gene Fiber delivers more than just high speed. It serves as a gateway to a world filled with limitless possibilities. Petty Gene Fiber. Better in, better service, better price. Trying to roll back into this fourth set here, needing it. The fourth and fifth, it's the siphon set in the semifinals. And off of the hands there of Emma Reynolds, and it's going to be a point back to the back of the game. Maybe And Proctor comes back in as Melton will be serving. 
Schaefer, and he couldn't do nothing with it. And Eustick was kind of in no man's land there. Making it 14 to 12. Still up in the air and out of bounds. 14 13 now. I waited for that one because I knew there was going to be a big come out of it. <laughs> Pasco will continue to serve. There's Pasco now. Crocker will just pop it across. Now Caroline Huff. Picked up there by Schaefer. She'll pop it back across. Nice dig there by Pratt. That'll bump it across. Now Smith. Now Pratt. Now Milton. Now that was Stockton. Stockton will move up. Now Houston. Now Smith. Now dug up there by Pasco. And there's a kill there for number 12. Caroline Huff, 14-14 now. Mr. Momentum is starting to change in this building. Yes, it is. The Conway Faithful has really come alive. Pasco Schaefer. Oh, what a try there by Pasco. That's going to be 15-14. Rebecca Golden Lady Arrows. Pasco goes out. Scroggins comes back in. That's this. Scroggins to serve for the lady. Oh, oh. Well, she didn't get hurt. Well, I am too. 15 15 now. Serving will be. Couldn't see him. Oh, was it? Couldn't see him. In the mind. Yeah, I couldn't see it. <laughs> and block of the net. Now Smith again. And I'm going to hit it back. Shaper's going to get it across. And out of bounds. Off of Schaefer as the Eagles take the lead 16 15. Been a while since the Eagles have had a lead. Kenny will get it across. Smith and Schaefer couldn't do nothing with it. 17-16. Kenley now continues to serve. As Crocker with the kill. 17-16 going up against Carver there. That's a great matchup. Yes. It's now going to be Marley Smith serving. Smith again across. She's going to now Carver. Carver picked up there by Melton again. Schaefer. Pratt's going to set up. Huff. Huff's going to be out of bounds. Oh, here's him. Oh, they're going to call it in. Whoa. That was close, Rob. Well, it was in, just by <laughs> inches. Rob. 15 16. Thank you. <laughs> Safer 
for a block of the net by number 10, Jenna Gale and Emma Carter. 1916 timeout, Lavaca. We'll take it with them. Stay with us here at the Triple A Digital Network. What's on your schedule for October 28th? Christian with the lead here in this fourth set. Behind the fourth set, fourth. In the siding set, Schaefer's going to get it across. And pushed back across by the Lady Eagles. That was Kinley. Kinley going to get it across over Shoesmith. Shoesmith will get it across out of bounds. Stops the run there for the Lady Eagles. They're on a big run there. And Proctor will be serving. Madison here. 17. gets it across. Off of Crocker's hands and out of bounds. 20 to 17. And that was number 17. Emma Carter with a bullet. Goggins with an ace. 21 to 17. This faithful Conway Christian can kind of feel it as they're trying to push this to a fourth or fifth and deciding set. The winner is definitely trying to swap it over. Oh, yeah, big time. Now Shaver's going to push it across. Now, oh. Oh my goodness. Gosh, a dig. What a dig there by Melton. Melton has done a great job tonight. Melton with another dig. And Schaefer going to have to hit across. Another dig there. And that was Reynolds. That was out. Out of bounds there for the Lady Eagles. That Lady Golden Arrows will be serving now. That's number 12, Willa Don Houston. about Pratt. Yeah. Schaefer's going to have to get it across. There's going to be too many hits. 22, 18 now. Coming to serve will be the senior, number two, Brooklyn Pratt. Stockton, big dig there by Pratt. Now Kinley set up Scroggins. Now Melton going to set up Stockton. Stockton moves it back across. Now Kinley to Rice. Rice is blocking the net, but it's out of bounds. Point for the Lady Eagles. Too hard there for Brooklyn Pratt. 23 19 now. And serving will be Emerson Schaefer. She's a southpaw. Yep. Maybe he was get across. That's Pratt. Schaefer used it. Hurt. Back corner. Out of bounds. Set point now for the Lady Eagles. And it's going to be number 32, Emerson Rice, serving it in that far corner. Rice will get it across. 
Oh, up about Pratt, or Scroggins. And into the net, 25, 8, 19. Lady Eagles take the fourth set. We're going five, as we kind of all figured it was going to happen, as we will be back for the fifth and the deciding set. Who's going to go? to the Banco ZK Arena to play Mansfield. We'll decide here in just a few minutes. The Play Digital Network. Two sets old, 25-1, 21-25-21. 21. Eagles battle back, take the next two, 25-18 and 25-19. And this one will go to 15 if you're not familiar with volleyball. And that's the first one to 15. Yep. Got to win by two, though. Yep. And then Ned Schaefer has Stockton and Schaefer kind of collided right there. And kind of just kind of knocked the momentum out of Schaefer there. And going to serve will be number eight, eight nine, nine six, yeah, ten. Yeah. There's Proctor. And there's a kill off of Shoe Smith's hands. Making it two to one now. You can't dig yourself a hole in this set here, or this set. Oh, no. Because you don't get that chance. Holly Smith, right up there by Shu Smith. Oh, nice dig there by Melton. Now, Smith, Schaefer, right up there by Shu Smith. Right there, Melton. Now, 
Smith's going to hit it across. And Reynolds. And her back across there by Caroline Huff. Rockins is going to bump it back across. What a volley we got going on here. Proctor is just going to bounce oh. away. But there's number 12. Caroline Huff was for a dig, but was out of bounds. And Kennedy couldn't do nothing with it. Proctor got it over, and it was just more than this could handle. Proctor's everywhere right now. Yeah. Smith continues to serve. Scroggins. Caroline Huff dug up again. Excuse me, that was Gail. Now Gail on the side. Dug up there by Milton. Stockton is over, and I get Stockton on Milton. She knew she did it too. And that's going to bring number 12, Caroline Huff, who serves. Everybody's going to be punching their ticket and get that every ride past to the finals to play the Mansfield Lady Tigers. And there's a block at the net by Emma Carver. And why not? We're not at three now. We'll try to keep you as much clear as we can, but we're going to here we go. Now Schaefer, out of bounds, point for the Lady Eagles. Still serving, number 12, Caroline Huff. Schaefer, too deep, 5-3 now. Both teams are accustomed to being here. Last year they played each other in the semifinals. It was Ovaca winning it. Now Proctor. Now Scroggins. And out of bounds off of number 32, Emerson Rice. Five to four now. Proctor will go serve. Across. Oh, up there for Houston. Houston will get across. Now Rice, block to the net. But it's going to be a point for the Lady Eagles. And Proctor goes out again after she serves. Welcome back in. And serving now will be Scroggins. Melton couldn't get back to it. Makes it seven to four now. Timeout. Yeah, we will take a rhythm here on the AAA Digital Network. If you'd like to go back and watch this, here is your QR code to scan. Here we go. to the AAA Digital Network live from Clinton High School in the beautiful Bulldog Complex as we are in the fifth and final deciding set. Lady Eagles of Conway Christian, seven to four, and now seven to five as that serve was out of bounds by Brooklyn Pratt. Excuse me, Kate Scroggins. That was a close one, but it yeah, was out. It was a very close one. Eastwick will serve. Across there by Jenna Gale. Now 
Back across by Schaefer. Now back side was Marley Smith. And still wow, what a dig. Used it again. Now Milton. Setting up Schaefer. Schaefer with a kill. Picked up there by Scroggins. Rice with a kill. Eight to five now. Coming in to serve will be number two, Brooklyn Pratt. She needs to get it over. Yep. Pratt, the senior. We'll get it across. There's an ace. As she comes in with an ace. These Lady Eagles were knocked off by Lavaca in the state semifinals last year. The Lavaca Lady Golden Arrows have been runner up for the last three years, or last two years. Last, out of the last four or three years, the Lavaca Golden Arrows have been runner up to the Mansfield Lady Union at the Tigers. Oh, Rice just gets it over. Now Schaefer's got to do something with it. Smith's going to bump it across. Now Rice. And the no man's land point for the Eagles. You can really tell this momentum is just, this arena is electric right now. Well, Conway Lee, the Eagle, I mean, look at the crowd. Look yeah. at the students here. Yeah. My goodness. They're trying to keep that camera clean as much as they can. Oh, what a dig. They're stocked oh. in point for the lady in the back of Golden Arrows. As Rice could not, her, her tires were spinning as she was going for Serving now will be Schaefer. Schaefer will get it across. That's number nine, Kinley. Out of out bounds. 11 to 6 now. Another timeout. Yes, sir. We'll take it with them. Stay with us here at the AAA Digital Network. Compliments of Lake Area Sports. In the heart of rural Arkansas, where community flows, there's a bond that ties us together. Petty Gene Fire. We understand the importance of local relationships. And that's why when it comes to connectivity, our customers deserve the best. Whether working from home, learning remotely, or connecting with loved ones, Teddy Gene Fiber delivers more than just high speed. It serves as a gateway to a world filled with limitless possibilities. Teddy Gene Fiber. Better internet, better service, better price. Serving will be number 20, Savannah Shoesmith. Shoesmith is going across. I used it. Give me Smith. Now Stockton. Wow, oh, oh. big dig. The Scoggins with a big dig, excuse me. And they're going to have a. Who hit it twice? The point there too. I guess yes. it went to come no. Oh, yep. no, 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 no. Yeah. 11 7 now. Yeah. Lavaca with the point. I didn't even see the whistle. Well, I saw the whistle, but I didn't hear, I didn't, I didn't know who it went to. That was a block of the net. Used it. Out of bounds. Oh, they're going to say it was off of the Lady Eagles, or Lady Golden Arrows, and it's going to be a point for the Lady Eagles. 12 to 7. We're trying to keep you as much as we can here because there's people standing up in front of us. It's confusing. Yeah. Whoa, that was way too deep. 12 to 8 now for the Lady Eagles. They can get a clear shot down here. <laughs> and serving will be Miss Stockton. She'll hit it across. Back across. She's Stockton now. Proctor. 
Now Scroggins will keep it back in the air. They get it back across. That's Proctor. Now put it up to the shoot, Smith. Now Caroline Huff for the kill. 13 to 8. And serving will be number nine, Ashlyn Kinley. Kinley will serve. Now Schaefer, picked up there by Shoesmith. Now Kinley. Now that was Yale getting it across. Now Smith into the net. 14 to eight. And still serving will be Ashlyn Kinley. Kinley will get it across. Now Proctor with a kill. It's going to be off shoes. Oh! Are they going to be able to get this across? No, they're not. 14 to 9. What a play there by Kate Scroggins. And serving now will be number 22, Marley Smith. 14-9, here it is. Blocked at the net there by number four, Madison Proctor, 14-10. They're not giving up. No, they're not. Marley Smith. With a good across. Henry, blocked to the net again, now Scroggins. Gets it back across, Schaefer. Proctor with the kill, 14 to 11. Time out, Conway Christian, we'll take it with him. Stay with us here at the AAA Digital Network. And welcome back here to the AAA Digital Network. 14 to 11, here it is. Now Milton. Setting up Schaefer, Schaefer! Oh. Is it still live? It is. Back across Huff. Now push back across, dug up there by Gale. Now Huff blocked with the net. The call by Christian Lady Eagles. Are getting their ever ride pass to Bank OZK Arena on Saturday to play at 1 o'clock against the Mansfield Lady Tigers. And they have met already once this year with Mansfield winning it. Yes, sir. And there is your Lady Eagles celebrating. Just momentarily, they will be getting their ever ride pass to the state championship game. Stay with us here. We'll be right back. Here it is. All right, ladies and gentlemen, there it is. They're coming over here to us. They're coming to that big student section as they have got their Everett Ride Pass 
to the Bank OZK Arena. And ladies and gentlemen, here's your matchup. It's the Mansfield Lady Tigers with a record of 34 and two, taking on the Lady Conway Christians Eagles with a record of 25 and one. It very well could be a great game at Bank OZK Arena. And that's at one o'clock. That is at one o'clock. Here's that schedule right here. I'll try to stop this ad. There's that schedule for the games. It is at 6A starting at 11 o'clock. 2A starting at one o'clock. 3A starting at three o'clock. 4A at five o'clock. 5A at seven o'clock. It's two hour intervals. They will clean the gym. Bring another set in. Clean the gym. Bring, bring another, another set, set in. Yep. At the Bank of OZK Arena. If you want to watch it, you can go to myarkansaspbs.org backslash sports for full details. And it's going to be on Arkansas PBS. Once again, it is the Lady Eagles of Conway Christian taking on the Mansfield Lady Tigers at 1 p.m. at Bank of OZK Arena. Congratulations to both schools there. We knew it was going to be a barn burner, Rod. Well, you know, hey, after the first two sets, I would I would have had to say the Lavaca Golden Arrows were going to take it. Yeah. We're going to go back for a rematch of last year. But then when the Lady Eagles won that first set, I thought, well, okay. And then that second set, there was no doubt. Yeah. And this third one was just well, here's what how you say? Here's how we got to it. It was Mansfield or Lavaca winning the first one, 25, or second, first and second set, 25-21. And then Conway Christian winning 25 18, 25 19, and 14 to 11, or 15 to 11 in that final set to win it all to take it on the Mansfield Lady Tigers. I want to send out a, best, a special thank you to Equipment High School. Yes. And, Co and Mr. Stacks, all our buried at the hospitality room, everybody here on campus. They have done a great job. Not, not having a team in the tournament. They've done a great job of covering everything, and they always do a great job. They're, they were phenomenal. I yes. mean, you just, I mean, they went out of their way. Yep. It was just like they had someone here. Yep. And, you know, so I want to give out a special thanks to them. I want to also give out a special thanks to Rodney, Debbie, Richard, Jacob Cater, yes. and for everyone at Lake Area Sports, we're signing off here from the 2A State Volleyball Tournament, and we will be back on air with basketball. Probably during state and regional tournaments, we'll be back on for the statewide coverage on the lake area coverage. We'll have, be back on tonight for basketball as well as football tomorrow night. You brought that basketball. Uh, I did notice today I got a copy of Rosebud's uh, yep. basketball, and they're hosting the district. Yes, they are. So. And so, All right, ladies and gentlemen, there's your final. Mansfield, Conway Christian, stay with us here. We'll see you all at the finals. Have a